It's time to attend the College of Pop Culture Knowledge. It's like quiz ball. Three trivia questions to find out who's smarter. Donna. Donna's a smart one. Or Steve. His brain ain't right, but it's fun. And here's your host. I am Grant. I want to see how smart you are. His brain is definitely not right if you're going to tune into this. YouTube series, you'll see. Steve, hey. what are you wearing right now, buddy? Uh, thank you for asking. <laughs> this is an old uh, H&M sort of like sweater button-up. The last time I wore it out of the house, my son said, why are you wearing mom's sweater? And uh, I just tossed it on just to differentiate a little bit. It's, you know, like one of these situations. It's revealing a little bit. Yeah, it's a Dave Clavage. Everybody loves the deep V. <laughs> is it distracting? Uh, Can no. you guys be professional or not? Not oh. really. <laughs> well, then I'm keeping the, it on so that I win the game. I don't want to see your nude chest. Can you see my chest hair? Ah, yes. Yeah. Yes. Dude, Grant, this has taken me, and I want to be clear, every single one of these 37 years to get here. And now nothing better than to get home at the end of a day and just stroke my own chest. Mm, yes. Think about the day's highs, the day's lows. <laughs> <laughs> Some people go with the beard. Steve just... Petting his I chest. do two hands right down here. <laughs> hmm. Nostrils oh, flared. Oh God, I don't want to see that. All right. Anyway, well, if you do watch this, be sure to like and subscribe for sure. We have Christine on the phone from Eden Prairie with us. Christine, how you doing? Hey, good. How you doing? I am Grant. I'm. I'm. <laughs> you know, thank you for asking. Nobody else oh, seems goodness. to do. No, I'm just kidding. Yeah. No, I'm doing great. I'm doing great. I'm doing great. Uh, I'm Christine, Grant. what time did you wake up this morning? Uh, three o'clock. Thanks <gasps> for asking. Why did you do that? <laughs> I don't know. I usually get up at four thirty. I'm trying to get appointments with that COVID thing, so I'm trying to. Oh yeah, you're checking the the vaccination yeah. line thing. Yeah, me too. Like every half hour. Wow. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. Good for you. Let's get. Get well, now that you, yeah, you've been up and ready here, it seems like, for a while now. So hopefully you've got some energy left. Hopefully you can get that vaccine, like Donna said. Do you want to play with Donna or Steve today? As you know, you can pick to play with one of the two. And once you know the topic, and today's topic is TV reboots. Christine, come with me. Let's go to victory Ooh. together. We can be buddies. Uh, what reboots? I am going to go with Steve. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to turn. Yeah. Television reboots, Donna. Television okay, reboots. Okay? okay, I'll see you guys you, later. Donna. I don't want to go. You have to. I'm not going to. Donna. <laughs> give it. Obey the rules. And All Christine, right. you're playing for a copy of Barb and Star. Go to Vista Del Mar, available oh. now on digital and on Blu-ray DVD. Excuse me, tomorrow it'll be on D Blu-ray and DVD April 6th. So enjoy that if you can win this, okay? Cool. All right. All right. So right. hold off till the end and see if you can help Steve out here. Steve, you ready to go? I'm ready. All right, bud. Looking good in your deep V there. Thanks, bro. HBO Max is producing a re reboot of this former CW drama series that starred Blake Lively. It will be set eight years after the original show's conclusion and follow a new batch of bratty rich kids. Gossip Girl. This after-school special reboot follows a new group of students at Bayside High and can be found on the streaming platform Peacock. Saved by the bell. I think Donna's reading my lips right now, by the way. I see what you're doing. Netflix brought back the Robinson family in a reboot of what sci-fi space drama that originally aired from 1965 to 1968? Um, meet the Robinsons. All right, that's it. All right, now we turn to our lifeline. Christine, are you ready to help Steve out in any way? Can you... You have yes, any... I am. Um, first two questions, I'm pretty sure he is correct on. And the last one is Lost in Space. Yes, that's my girl. That's my yeah. girl. You know why? Because when you're from the Wemo, the West Metro, you stay together. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Absolutely. Right on, Steve. Nice. We yeah. got this. Yeah, bring back Donna. Good job. You like that show, by the way? Uh, didn't it I go do. away after a year? Oh, oh, hey, never mind. Donna's oh, back. Donna's back. Hey, hello. hello. Donna's hey. Hi, Donna. Hi. Hey, how you feeling? Very great. Awesome. I'm super jacked up. <laughs> there, There's no margin, <laughs> Donna. There is zero margin, okay? Okay. A little pressure. Yeah. Christine right. hooked it up. Yeah, we did have a little up there from Christine. Damn it, Christine. <laughs> uh, why do you hate me? All right, Donna, here we go. Okay. HBO Max is producing a reboot of this former CW drama series that starred Blake Lively. It will be set eight years after the original show's conclusion and follow a new batch of bratty rich kids. The OC? That's not right. 
This after school special reboot follows a new group of students at Bayside High and can be found on the streaming platform Peacock. Oh, that's that one with Tiffany Amber Thiessen, those guys. I can't remember the name of the show. Saved by the Bell? Netflix brought back this Robinson, the Robinson family in a reboot of what sci-fi drama that originally aired from 19... 19- Lost in Space. Okay. Uh, and the first one, I don't think it's the OC because it's something loosely <sighs> scripted, but not really. Oh, well, there I go. <laughs> yes. Shoot. And Hang sh- on. I can't stroke my own chest there. You guys, it's like doing radio in prison. Do we have to make it an event? <laughs> hey, you know what? Uh, he can he can stress, uh, scratch those chest hairs proudly, Steve. You did win today. Oh, yes. Donna, you were so close Woo! there. Good job with Lost. The last one was Lost in Space, yeah. and Christine actually came back. I said meet the Robinsons. Yes. That was and, close. And uh, Christine saves Steve with that one. Second one was Saved by the Bell. The after school special that follows students around Bayside High, which you both got correct. And the first one, Donna, it was Gossip Girl, unfortunately. Oh, I wouldn't Not, have gotten that. No. Nope. Yeah. Blake Lively, I figured might kind of help you guys out. I didn't know Blake Lively was in Gossip Girl. She was in the original. Yep. I think she was like the main character in the original. Really? Yep. No. Is that the one with um what's her face from Mighty Ducks? Lauren Graham. No, you're thinking of Gilmore Girls. I was. Mm-hmm. I was. Okay. Good yes. game. So that, good thank game. you. That means yeah. Christine has won herself a digital download of Bob and Star. What does it go? Uh, go to Vistel Del Mar. So that should be a fun movie to see. Dawn McLean loved it. I heard it was pretty funny. Donna did not like it, right? Mm. Okay. Oh, she's pleading the fifth because it's a prize. It's very subjective. <laughs> it's yeah. subjective. Christine, you're going to love it. Yes, and it was all you that saved Steve there and got yourself that victory. So give yourself a huge pat on the back or a scratch on the chest, as Steve would say. Yeah. Right. <laughs> nice I'm job. all over it. Nice Thanks. job. I know uh, Jason Matheson loves it, so. Oh, good. Oh, he good, loved good, Barb good. and Star? Yeah, right yeah. There. He's all over that. So I've been dying to see it. Oh, so, good. Cool. Good. Thanks, Well, thanks Christine. for listening, Christine. Congratulations. Stay on the line. Okay. Okay. So Grant, what is the total count? The total what count is after today, 38. Stevie Boy, 25, Donna. Now, I think I'm on a tear. And because of that, like, I think I've been winning quite a few of these in a row. Mm-hmm. You're going but, on vacation next week. This is true. But because of that, I am not going to take issue with, if I may have the floor for a moment. <laughs> uh, let's see here. We've got some mail. Right? I got some mail. Can we hit the mail? Oh, sure, sure. So this came from uh, Jeff. Jeff sent the email regarding the pop culture knowledge, college of pop culture knowledge from Friday. Okay. Okay, though. (laughs) Steve needs to know what happened with the last question with Donna and the caller on Friday. Mm -hmm. I don't think Donna should get that point. You guys have start, stated that you cannot talk that much with the caller, coaching them to an answer. You guys need to discuss this and see what Steve says about it. Grant should play that back for Steve to listen to. I love you, Donna, says Jeff. It's okay, Jeff. But I think you cheated. I don't think I meant to cheat. No, I don't think it was an intentional cheat. I think um... oh, if you need it to be... A 12 game gap, fine. You that's can have why, it. listen. <laughs> that's why I'm not gonna I'm not gonna push it. Okay. 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 I just push. think that the the listener probably should have the last word because it's their game, right? Do we get to talk it through with them? What is our what's our standing on that? Do we get to 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 massage it? Oh, I don't think that's right. Or oh yeah, that's right. Originally I thought we had not, but we're what we are going. That's the, that's that's what we're gonna do. So if they want to talk through, if you guys want to talk through you your can. lifeline, you can talk through your lifeline. You just can't give them the answer. You can kind of walk them there. Grant is uh he's a man of the people. Yeah, I'll do that. He's a man of the people. Yep, we'll we'll have to go that route. <laughs> what do they have? Bless certs? <laughs> In Texas. In Texas. <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. He. I'm Donna. sorry, Jeff. Thanks. Thanks for. I don't. I don't like to break rules. And if I'm anybody sorry. has any ideas, uh, feel free to email the show or me for we topics. Help Donna. <laughs> I seriously think I've won like eight or nine of these in a row. I think I'm on a crazy tear right now. I well, thought it was kind of close. 
Now it's 38 to 25? 38 26. I said 25 because that one was still up in the air. So now we are 38 26. And I oh. I just uh I have to say, you and I are very similar in mind, you know, we're same age, we're guys. So if yeah, I could get buddies. some help, you know, maybe we could get some topics that aren't not saying that I, you know, am going in your direction in the per in purposefully, but I kind of sure. tend to lean that way. So I've I've always maintained that Donna has a little bit of an advantage in the college of pop culture, excuse me, in the millennial X games that we play Wednesdays at eleven thirty, because respectfully, Donna, hear me when I say this. You have lived more. You've lived more. You are seasoned. Yeah, you're experience. right. You're right. Because I've lived through your era and my own. Yes. You've I just only... trust that there was a blurry drug phase for about 15 years. <laughs> Things that would be legal now. So like, don't get crazy. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching our funny videos. They're funny, aren't they? Aren't they? If you would hit like and subscribe, we'll do something really great for you. Like, I don't know, mm, give you a great big high five after the pandemic. I will need a vaccination card.